big deal. Big stands for before it's gone. And we all understand the importance and the popularity of the lid lifter. But we also love that we can open pop top cans. We can do all that with this, but that's only one part of the two pieces that we're going to offer you today from Kuhn Rakan. This is not only going to be the lid lifter, but also the jar opener. There's that pop top opener because we know now that so many cans are moving toward that pop top. But then it also includes the jar opener. If it fits inside the tool, it will open that jar. It will also open something as small as a one, two, or three liter soda bottle. Mark Charles Massilli is back with us, our gadget guru. And these are two of the most popular and most requested items mm -hmm. from Kuhn. Yep. We just finally put them together. Correct. And made them compact. We are now premiering the first ever, in 22 years I've been selling this, compact can opener. It fits in the palm of my hand. You saw this last year, this compact palm holding jar opener was so popular, we had to make the can opener and then make them as a set. We have never done this, folks. This is the premiere of the first ever compact can opener. First time putting the two pieces together. It's everything you need to open up in your kitchen and it's compact. All right, now we you have- got colors. We have colors. And you know what, I can go through this in a second, but I would love yeah. for you to just to, to show the two things- that Great, let's, so let's do that. Are the, the two tools and the multiple things. So the I first thing I'll talk about is the jar opener. You'll see this compact. I'm gonna flip it so you see what's happening behind it, right? I'm gonna open those arms up. I'm gonna pull. What I love about this jar opener is when I close this, it locks into place. So that is the technology, which is, gives you the leverage. So I go over big, close it. Now when I clamp this, I actually got three points of contact. Watch this. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. It opens up any jar with all the leverage. You need zero strength because of that great technology of three points of contact and that squeezing with your hand. To release, you can open up like this. To put it back away, close, close, and now it's back into its compact position. So that's position. one of the two pieces. That's number one, right? Now we're gonna talk about the first ever compact can opener. I cannot stress this enough, everybody. It's auto attach. It's everything I've been selling for 22 years. This has never changed. This is the patent technology. This is the same. So instead of doing this that we're used to with a regular can opener, you're gonna go up top. And again, the little secret is that little wheel is right to the side of there. And all you're gonna do is twist. We just made this compact. It's easy, it fits in the palm of your hand. You're gonna have the leverage from above. You go around once, you're gonna feel it a little bit up, just like I did there. Go backwards, and believe it or not, I opened up this can. We, of course, gave you the bird beak, because we had to do that. <laughs> and open this up, and now no sharp can, no sharp lid, no interaction with food because no bacteria is gonna grow. Why? It didn't touch the food and no metal shavings inside your food. Done. A big deal price of $29.98 and yes, I have colors. Let's take a look at colors. This is the red. Very popular already is the red. Then I've got it for you in green or lime. Then this color is called aqua. Beside that is the gray. Then we have tangerine. Tangerine, my favorite color. And then finally we have it in eggplant which is a fancy word for purple. Um, all right, now, I, I would tell you we're also limited in the eggplant. Okay. A thousand sets, 1,000 sets are gone. I love this. Again, I'm gonna reiterate, we introduced this can jar can opener last, yeah. All right, so, so the place idea, it on here put first. it on yep. And push, then push, push it, it in. Now squeeze. Now squeeze the There's the leverage, it. yep, now go. And now, I can open my, there, done. look at that. And that was a big size jar that David opened and you notice how much vacuum was on there when he pulled it. So that leverage gives you that vacuum. So when you open it, it's releasing what oh, the factory no. put in there. Olives came and in a jar so big. Well, if you love olives, that's how they I come. Yes. Okay, what I love about the jar opener also, one other tip, if you have things that are wrapped in plastic, foil, paper, it's skips one of the steps. I don't have to touch this, right? This is completely wrapped is this in barbecue? barbecue sauce, right? So watch this, it's strong enough to go around and take off not just the, the lid, but it's gonna break the seal, look at that. So it actually eliminates one of the steps. Now, Mark that you Charles, have to do. what if I use this barbecue sauce to make barbecue chicken, and then some spills on the side and I put the lid back on? Doesn't that start to really get sticky and Congeal? hard? Yeah. yeah, so think of maple syrup, think of cough syrup. Oh, Honey. speaking of which, the jar opener also opens up medications. So if you, these child safeties, Locks are on there are for push and twist. Now you don't need the leverage, it opens it right up for you. How great is that? Wow, look at so that. So it's really the only jar opener you ever need, but now it fits in the palm of your hand. You know what I'm thinking you could probably also do? What? I think if you open this a little bit, wait, take that lid oh. off. Yeah. And then There you go. It opens the foil, yep. the safety film. Yep. Yeah. So it's always that. something. So there's that. Now again, back to my favorite, which is brand new today. 
Cannot stress this, 22 years, never had this before. Look at the size of this, folks. It fits in the palm of my hand. It's gonna fit in any drawer. It's great for RVs, campers, camping, small apartments, small you know, um, college dorms. Never have we done a compact set this small that fits in the what palm of your hand. What if you went into that junk drawer, you know the one that doesn't close because the big spatula is in there? Yeah, that one. That one? Um, yeah, go in there and get rid of those tools that you never use, donate them. Correct, of course. And replace it with these two. And again, having the mechanism be the same, I cannot stress this enough, we didn't change anything here. All we did was make it compact, but it's still user friendly. And now you've got no sharp edge, no sharp edge. That's tomato paste, folks. And please take a look at my can opener. You don't see one ounce of that tomato paste anywhere on there. Why? It doesn't touch the food. No cross-contamination. So 2,000 sets are now gone. Let's go through colors again and remind you that we have lots of colors for you to choose from. And these are brand spanking new today. Set of two in the red. Set of two in lime. Set of two in aqua. Set of two in the gray. That next color is called tangerine, and the last color is called eggplant. Now, well over 2,000 of these are gone. It's a big deal. Big stands for before it's gone. So you want to get your set before it's gone. These are two of the most popular items on their own from Kuhn Rakan. Yep. So what we did is we put them together and made them smaller. And we haven't talked about the fact that 68% of the cans now have pull tabs. We thought of that because when I say you're going to open up any can, you're going to open up the majority there. But remember, you got the little hook right there. That's to get the little pull tab. So what you're going to do is I'm going to go down, put it on your counter, flip underneath, let it do all the work for you, and pull back. Now, I want to point something out. This is something we cannot eliminate, the sharp edge. That's still a sharp edge, folks. But look at where my hands are. I've got one around the can and one this far distance. So that's the secret behind those pull tabs is we can't eliminate the sharpness, but we can keep your hands safely away, and that's with that hook. And then you take this and you yep. work it back and forth. Isn't that great? You, you ready? And then dispose of that carefully, and so then you're any good. can, again, remember, this is auto-attached, folks. So there's that, and I want to point out, no blade there. So you're never going to get hurt. It's never going to touch the food. You reverse it to release, and, of course, the bird beak. You see that? Tweet, tweet. Tweet, tweet, and then of course the hook that we gave you in there for the for the pull tabs, all in one palm of your hand, first time ever. Now this is great also for things like salad dressing, mm -hmm. capers. Oh, what else do you have? Oh, white vinegar. Have you discounted your coffee maker lately? Yeah, right there. Um, or if you're buying, now this is white cooking wine. Yep. Mm. Fancy, right? Fantastic. We're getting fancy here. Um, or if you're thinking about things like uh, bottled oils and things that you're buying, my new favorite is avocado oil. A really good oil to be using. What is this? Is that hand sanitizer? Alo, alo, alo. Oh, that's aloe. Yeah. So when you have a sunburn, like oh. I get, like I get every year all the time because I don't wear proper sunscreen. This is what I need to put on my body to well, you're very fair reduce the lobster Charles. effect on you're me. You're very fair complexion. I know. I know. I'm fair and sensitive, so I have to watch use my aloe. Well, I want you to use your aloe. Mm -hmm. I want you to wear sunscreen. Does that help my sun. sensitivities too? Um, well, it'll help your sensitivity to the sun. Oh well, at least that, right? I can't help you with the other. Mm -hmm. So when my friends burn me, what do I do? Don't use aloe. <laughs> oh. Again, remember, folks. I'm well, I mean, I suppose you could. I'm going to turn this like this. You can throw it out. You're going to open up that arm. You're going to adjust it to what you want. When you close this, this locks. That's the technique and the mechanism and the patent technology. You have three points of contact. So go over, close, and again, just to show you what's happening underneath. Three points of contact. One, two, and three. See that? And then that gives you the leverage. So all you're going to do, I always say, do things on the counter. Okay? So I'm going to hold this. And give it a, a little push. You need zero strength and, that and has paper on or and plastic, on. plastic, folks. One less step, no matter what's Excuse wrapping. Excuse my reach. But yeah, I go, go. To just show this. Look at this big. We this like, is 46 ounces. We call of that sweet mammoth size. Bread and butter. Pickles. Would you like me to open it up? Would you? Again, we're gonna take our compact. We're gonna open it up like this. We're gonna pull it, stretch, put it over the lid, then squeeze, close, and I just locked it. Just to so see what's happening, right? So I locked it, grabbed the, the jar, and by the way, this is a big jar. I can't I get around the it. vacuum seal. See that? And it came right off. You never can need help. Can I smell help. the bread and butter pickles? Please do. You can eat the bread and butter pickles if you want. Oh, it smells so good. Isn't it awesome? There's probably a fair amount of sugar in there. Look at the size of this can opener. Oh, my word. <laughs> I'm so excited about so this So good. Can I opener. love bread and butter pickles. Look at this guy. Hi. I look, Hi, he's little a guy. little guy. He's a little guy. All right, now, please <laughs> use QBC.com and your mobile apps. Carla Hall, have you ever made chow chow? Yes, I've made chow chow. Yes, she's made chow chow. She's southern. Come yeah, on. chow chow is delicious. Chow chow is delicious. Mm. With some greens, beans, hot dogs, and everything else. And hot eggs. dogs and eggs, yes. <laughs> All right, here is your red. Carla Hall's coming up. We also have lime. This is aqua. We also have it in gray. Move on over to tangerine. 
and finally the eggplant. How many in this show now, Mike? 4,000 sets have been ordered. And remember, you're getting the jar and the lid lifter. Mm -hmm. They're both compact All jars, size, all cans. And they fit in the, literally in the palm of your hand. How cool is that? That's great. And these are our two most popular gadget uh, yep. products from Kun Rakan. They've been for me for 22 years. Absolutely. And so it just made sense we put them together and make them smaller, right? Yep. And that's the whole idea. Remember, folks, you're not losing any quality. You're not losing any technology in this. We just made it smaller than it's ever been. So it fits anywhere. Compact, 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 but still all the great technology that you love about Kun Rikon. All right, Mark Charles Basili, is this your only product today? That's it. This was important, so I came in for this, and this was all I, didn't I needed. Say it wasn't important. No, I'm just, just letting just you know. You if, if you had any other products. This was a big deal. We're gonna miss you if you're not here. I know, but I'm in spirit, always with you. Always, always, always. And don't throw aloe on people who throw shade. Fine, you. All right. Maybe shade is what you need because of the sun. Yeah, it's, I mean, it could be. All right.